Today, I'm going to show you how to make a bet on Polymarket. So Polymarket is a decentralized information market where you can make bets on a wide variety of real world events. See an example of a few different bets here. Some of them are about pricing of cryptocurrency on a certain day or something like uh, earthquakes or things in the media. So to start off we're, here, we're going to click the sign up button and you can do this with an email address or you can do it with MetaMask, which is what I'm going to do here. So I'm going to do MetaMask, sign this transaction. Now I'm going to hit deposit. So from here, I'm going to deposit USDC. So it'll say uh, send USDC from your MetaMask on Polygon. You can also do on the Ethereum mainnet network, although that's going to incur more fees. You can also use a credit or debit card with its own fees listed here. So this is the address that I'm going to send to. So I'm going to copy that and then go to MetaMask, send, paste in that uh, address, switch to USDC, put in the amount that I want to deposit, next, and confirm that transaction. So now I just have to wait for that transaction to go through. All right, that transaction has now gone through and we can see that we have a $10 USDC balance. And so we're going to go back to the market section and I'm going to make a bet on this market. So will the total value locked in DeFi be uh, $115 billion or higher on November 27th? So important part to check out here is the about this market section. So this is the part that will tell you specifically how this market will resolve, under what conditions will, uh, will the market resolve to either the yes or the no option. And then we can see at the top sort of trade volume and liquidity it has. And then over here, we have the pick outcome section. So you can see the price on a yes outcome and a price on a no outcome. So what this means is that currently the market is thinking that there is a 92% chance that the outcome will be a no. So it will be, so the total value locked in DeFi will be below 115 billion. And so you can put in how much that you want to bet on a particular outcome. You can see if I bet yes here, uh, the there would be a uh, potentially a pretty large return on this because this is the uh, more unlikely bet. We can go with the no option. And this is the returns, potential returns displayed for making this bet. One thing to note is that the top part is the current prices, and then the bottom part is the price uh, or the odds you would receive depending on how large your bet is. So if I increase my bet significantly, my bet size due to the smaller amount of liquidity, it would mean that the odds are pushed uh, from 92 cents to 99 cents. And so for these markets, uh, each, uh, each market will resolve at a dollar. So uh, the closer this gets to being a dollar, the lower the profit margin on this bet. So I'm gonna stick with just a $10 bet and that has very little impact on the current odds for this market. And so now I'm going to hit buy And here we can see in the confirmation, the order amount, and then your average price. So we see that uh, the, I'm getting a price at 94 cents out of a dollar per share. And then I can see the number of shares bought, shares I'll buy. 
accept terms of service and confirm and sign this MetaMask transaction. And wait for the processing to happen here. And then sign again. All right, now I have a confirmation here that the buy order was successful. You can look in my portfolio section and see the current portfolio value. And it's showing a slight uh, loss just because I've moved the market slightly with my bet. And let's see, you can look at liquidity. And I can hit trade here and it'll go back to uh, back to this page here and see how the price changes over time. And then when uh, and then at the end of this period, I'll be able to, depending on the outcome of this bet, I'll either be able to redeem my shares at a dollar per share if I'm correct, or they'll expire worthless if my bet was incorrect. That's all for now. I hope you found this video useful and I'll see you in the next one.